Rebecca is a crazy cuddle baby. What? Day. Crazy cuddle baby day? Today is Crazy Cuddle Baby Day. It's not nothing. It's not even a tag. I just thought that we would play with some cuddle babies because if you guys make it to the end of the video, you guys are going to get a sneak peek at October's giveaway baby. And then this will all make sense to you. But before we get started, a couple quick updates is we will be going live on Saturday, 4.30 p.m. Central for all of my Cloud Insiders and 5 o'clock p.m. Central for everyone else. And well, you guys, it's a new layout on the live streams. That's right. We sampled it on Sunday, but I'm excited. I'm going to play around with some colors and some lighting and stuff like that. And hopefully it's a rip-roaring fun live show <clears throat> for you guys to see some of the changes. You guys... I do have um, a test video up where it was successful and I did a surprise live. So you guys can go back and watch it and then you guys make sure and tune in to tomorrow because tomorrow is Wreck It Wednesday, Wawa Angels Nursery style. That's right, we're going to have Sawyer as a guest and well one of my toddlers is going to be with us too. I mean. They just have to be. I have to have a little bit of toddler hands because Sawyer is still a baby. But Sawyer is going to be in it. And it's all going to be Wawa Angels Nursery themed um, wreck it journal. So that will be a fun memory to put into our book. And also you guys make sure you tune in to Sunday. Because it is um, blah, 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 Brain Fart Choose Your Adventure Part 3. We are slowly getting closer. The grand finale will be the week of Halloween. So we've only got a couple more weeks to go, you guys. That's right. So it'll be part three. And then this week's Maddie Monday is jack-o'-lanterns. Pumpkins, jack-o'-lanterns, whatever you want to do. If you don't celebrate Halloween, maybe a favorite recipe that you use using pumpkin. Or maybe a pumpkin story. Or a pumpkin collage. Or whatever you want to do. I'm going to be carving a jack-o'-lanterns with one of my Maddies. That's right. That's what I'm going to do. So, let's go ahead and move on to the video. And that is where we're going to start out. And I'm going to show you all of my cuddle babies. Cuddle babies, to me, are the underdog superhero in the Reborn dolls. Um, and the reason I say that is because if you get a... I do have cuddle babies that is manufactured... Um, and I've also got an authentic painted reborn, and then I've got a um, cuddle baby, and then I got one I made myself. But to me, they're the unsung heroes. That's right. That's why I wanted to base this video around superheroes. Because for anybody that doesn't have a cuddle baby, they really are underdogs in the reborn community. Most of the time, they are painted exquisitely their heads. Just think about it. They're not paying attention to their body or their hands or their feet they're literally putting all the focus the artists are on the head which means some cuddle babies are exquisitely done and i have one that is exquisitely done that i'm going to show um and so the, another great thing about cuddle babies is they're super posable so my first cuddle baby i'm going to show is katie and katie is actually about 37 38 years old she is vintage 
She is, and my daughter actually gifted her to me, and my daughter found her at a thrift uh, flea market. Like, she was walking around in a flea market, and, well, she found Katie. Katie's video will be coming up in the Throwback Thursdays. That's another thing we will be doing this week, because next up, I believe in the lineup, is Ezra. So, Katie will be part of that Throwback Thursdays when I get to her. But, um, she was, my daughter brought her to me, and she's a Madame Alexander doll, and while she is a fourth limb cuddle babies, for me, any doll that has fourth limbs and fourth, you know, feet, to me is, and I'll show you, I do have her in a onesie, so this is going to be kind of hard, well, I, I can't show her, but her limbs literally goes to here, so I don't, I'm not sure if that's, what that's considered, but to me, she is a fourth limb cuddle baby, essentially. And so I just love her because she is done by Madame Alexander. And well, she looks like a cute little six month old baby, wouldn't you guys say? But cuddle babies are so poseable. Um, that's why I love them. For photography, if you're really into taking pictures of your reborns, cuddle babies are really the way to go. You know, as long as you cover them up properly, cover their little hands and feet, because I do have some authentic cuddle babies. <clears throat> when I say authentic, I mean they are cloth, down to their little cloth crabby hands. And their cloth crabby feet. They are authentically all cloth besides their heads. And so they are like so poseable. And if they're weighted well, now Joshua is my um, little boy cuddle baby. And um, the reason I do not mess with him a lot is I bought him from Etsy before I even started my channel. He was my first official cuddle baby. <clears throat> and well, he is so acute, as you guys can see, but he leaks. I see no holes in his body anywhere that this could be leaking from and it's not a lot but it's enough that whenever I mess with him glass beading which is good I could tell it's either glass beading or sand it's something that he's weighted with is coming out so I don't do a lot with him I think I need to get a different body maybe just uh, maybe just take him apart and redo him with just polyfill or something and get the beading or the sanding out but anyway this is joshua and so he is a manufactured um cuddle baby and you could tell that because of his face absolutely stunning good job on doing him and as you can see he is so like just in your arms he's just like so out he's just out and they can be they can be cuddled and cuddle babies are weighted and so they're really great for like um anxiety if you have like anxiety or maybe you're having a stress moment i can hold one of my cuddle babies and their weight and their weight on me which vinyl and cloth does the same thing and silicone does the same thing but a cuddle baby will meld into your arms and um, they're not stiff at all they're very floppy just like a baby so they're great for posing they're great for snuggling so i absolutely mwah, love my cuddle babies love them love them love them and so then I, my next cuddle baby i'm going to show is hootie and well hootie um, is very light. Hootie is not weighted at all. And Hootie was not actually meant to be a cuddle baby. No, she wasn't. She is a Behringer baby. Now, if you guys go back and watch her failing of me trying to put her on a cloth body with her limbs, it did not work. It did not work. I don't know why, but it did not work. So, the only option that I felt like I had to save Hootie to be able to put her into where I can hold her and love her and hug her was to turn her into a cuddle baby. So her body was essentially sent to me by Jess from Crafty Churchy Nursery and she was a gift. The whole Behringer baby was a gift to me from Bella over at Cherubs and Bubs. And so essentially that's what I turned Hootie into. Now I do have my Laura that I tried to turn to a cuddle baby that we have not brought because she's a fail and until I fix her she's not going back on camera. Anyway, so she has just got a cute little um, hootie body. It's just a little owl body for anybody that doesn't remember the video. And, well, she will stay a cuddle baby, essentially, for now. And then the last cuddle baby in my collection I want to show, and the reason I saved her for last, is Jenny. Jenny's little hat is coming off. 
Anyway, Jenny is um, a full body cuddle baby also. She is not as heavy as Joshua, but she is weighted. And she is authentic painted cuddle baby. Meaning her head was done by an artist. And the artist that created her is Creations by Kay. And well, there's a reason I saved Jenny for last. She was beautifully done. She's weighted to, for me, to perfection. As you can see, cuddle babies love to just melt. They just melt in your arms, just like a real baby would do. And so I love cuddle babies. And so, like I said, this one was painted by Kay. And she is just a dream. A, a dream. I always wanted a girl cuddle baby since I had Joshua. And so now I have my little girl. Named after a very special, special subscriber, Jenny. Hi, Jenny! <laughs> and so that brings us to this part of the video. So, with that being said, the reason I wanted to focus on cuddle babies is, you guys, we have another baby up for the month of October. Now, with that being said, this is your sneak peek video. This is not the giveaway video, and this is not the giveaway video that you enter on. I just wanted to give you guys a sneak peek. This giveaway will be um, uh, maybe a couple weeks from now yet, towards the ending of the month, like I like to do my giveaways. And so, um, I just wanted to remind you of this baby. Kay graciously donated this baby to me for my 1,500 subscriber giveaway. But it could be months before I get to 1,500 subscribers. And I couldn't stand leaving the babies I gave away last month for the month of September. This baby. And then I have another one. A Bella's baby will be up next month. Um, and so I just can't. I can't stand it. I cannot stand it. So I decided to go ahead and start giving these babies away now. And we'll figure out something else special to do when I hit my 1,500. So I'm not going to show you what's in the bag. Because essentially this is a sneak peek. But this will be coming with your baby when we start this giveaway. Like I said, sneak peek means I'm not going to tell you what's in that bag. You guys can go back, but it's been a few months ago that you can go back and watch her unboxing. Um, but it has been a while, you guys. Fair warning. So um, I'll, we will show what comes with her when we do that video. Like I said, sneaky peeky. So essentially what this baby is, which to die, 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 you guys. Um, essentially this is a little cuddle baby, like I said, painted by Kate. And this little darling is adorable. Adorable. You'll get the pretty receiving blanket, of course. She comes with her own little lovey. Well, it's not a lovey, you guys. It's a... Uh, Passy clip so you guys will get the passy clip and you guys will get the binky and so who are you guys gonna win at the end of the month oh. <gasps> this little face is so cute you guys oh my goodness I thought about messing with you guys and just stopping and not showing you guys no more. And then you guys got to go in or wait until I do the giveaway. But that's not exactly fair, is it? So I'm not going to do that. And here she is. This is your guys' little cuddle baby. That will be up for this month's giveaway towards the end of the month. Again, I repeat myself. But I'm going to go ahead and repeat it. This is not the giveaway video. So if you put enter me or anything like that, it's going to go on deaf ears because this isn't the giveaway video. This is your sneak peek of what's coming up in a couple of weeks up for grabs. And so that's why I wanted to show her. She's beautifully done, beautifully painted by Kay. Gorgeous. We will also look at her details whenever I do the official giveaway video. This was just your sneak peek. So. I think that's going to do it for us today, guys. Like I said, I just wanted to pull her out. I wanted to show her to remind you guys because it has been quite a few months ago that this little sweetheart was unboxed. Um, and so I feel horrible because, again, like I said, she has been in her box for quite a while. Kept very safely for you guys. And again, um, so... As, you know, as soon as I get up the money that I can go ahead and ship her, that's whenever I will be doing the
the giveaway for her. And so I do know that I do have a couple of days that I'm working. Uh, I'm just going to stop there till I can be off camera and fix her a little bit. And so who do I want to hold? Who do I want to hold? Let's go ahead and honor Kay. And let's go ahead and hold Jenny. So anyway, um, I just wanted to do that. I just wanted to kind of refresh you guys' memory of the baby. Like I said, next month, November's giveaway is Abella's baby. And I already have him or her put up for you guys. And so I think that's going to do it for us today. If you like this video, then go on down there and give us that big thumbs up. And well, while you're down there, why don't you go ahead and subscribe. It's free. It doesn't cost anything. And well, me and all of my babies, we really love you guys. So until the next video, everybody. Bye. Let me tell you about